this contraption here is to show there's the general idea that you can run uh, the RS-485 network and the TCP IP network uh, using the same wire that's why this one is blue uh, this can be like 50 meters the usual you know Ethernet lawn cable around the house etc etc I got myself a few keystones as you can obviously tell and uh, wired it all up so the stick is this beauty runs as usual and it obviously communicates over the uh, blue wire which is the long one now the other thing is I got a Raspberry Pi which is not connected yet as you can probably still see the LEDs are not on and I got a switch that is on so what's happening they are on two different parts of the network one's connected to this side and the other one to this side so very straightforward if I just decide to plug this in here you go it's connected and the Raspberry Pi should tell me the exact same story here you go it's now the amber and green so they are now all connected and this is still working so yeah it is possible to run your uh, home automation Modbus network RS over RS485 and an Ethernet network using the same wire so you don't have to uh, you know run another cable through it well however it comes with a caveat because uh, this uh, Ethernet connection only runs at what 100 megabits a second now because you're just using the four wires so two pairs and not all of them which obviously explains why it works the economizer business again uh, however it will be more than enough if you just have a one ethernet cable that you already run in the walls to uh, you know connect other IOT devices and this setup will be more than happy to accommodate that however if you need to uh, use it as a data um, you know for wire like a normal streaming service and yeah the other the computer usual stuff that might not be enough uh, because it's what it's uh, 10 megabytes uh, give or take I think a second which might not be perfect but still proof of concept it works um, uh, I had the hunch that's done the work but uh, you know it's the real world and uh, what's inside one's head doesn't always uh, you know, comfort like the uh, infinity motion devices that should work on paper but never work due to um, uh, what you call it laws of nature and physics and all that stuff. Um, so, yeah, that's it for today. Uh, thanks for watching, I guess. Cheers.